I, I need the full 411 on how Mike Vrabel goes into a meeting with the owner and general manager of the team and comes out without a job. Right. And I do not know why Mike Vrabel is an unemployed head coach today. Two years after being coach of the year and being a guy who everybody who's coached by him loves him. And you basically... I, I, we're, and we're wondering about how that stone ripples into the pond up there in New England, where you're hearing nothing again. It's now three days since the, the snow started to thaw against the Jets. Three days. Seems like uh, Ian Rapport uh, was saying on the insiders that uh, yeah. Titans ownership was kind of irked by Vrabel going to New England for the ceremony to be inducted into the Pats Hall of Fame in the in middle, a bye week? in the yeah, on the bye week. It's a bye week. That's insane. it's a day. What he's not supposed to in the middle go? in the middle of their year, I guess. What does that mean? I don't know. If that's the case, come on, just get over yourselves. Like he's yours. He gives his heart and soul. Like if you see how he operates on his job, if he if he operated in his job like he didn't care, and then he shows up you know, and takes the red jacket from the crafts and sits in their box. You you sit there and go, oh, you're offending us? That's crazy. If that's really the case. Also, there was the quote yesterday it. that uh, they didn't want to work out a trade because they thought it would be too complicated and take too long. Well, that I understand. And then, then... The people, like if it takes too long, then you can't hire the person that you'd want to hire to let him be traded. Right. That I, I understood that. But if this is really, you know, we don't think you're with us completely because on a bye week when everybody's allowed to go wherever they want for a day, that he, you wind up in the home of the spot. By, by the way, it's the same guy who ended the Brady-Belichick era in that building for you in the playoffs in his coach of the year two years after that. You know, I mean, get out. It's the, Adam Schefter came on our 20th anniversary show on NFL Network. You know? So what does that mean? He, he doesn't want to compete against Ian and, and Tom Pelissero and Mike Garofolo? Is that what it means? Is that what it means? Did you give him a, well, I don't know what color the jacket would be at NFL Network. No, but, but, but in all honesty, though, it, it's just like that's his history. That's his past. He wanted to celebrate. One year, fans voted him in the, in the Hall of Fame. Yeah. But he's supposed to say no. I'm the head coach of the Tennessee Titans. I'm sorry. That's crazy if that has anything to do with it. Because I'll tell you what, when I had a meeting with him in Tennessee, he was all about Titans football. That's it. And he was kind of miserable. You could see that they weren't performing very well. Wow. That is nutty. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern, for free.